So, hello everyone. Well, the droid's right. If we disable him, the Sith will probably wipe his memory chips and take him to the junk pile. But if we can rig a backup memory chip with a timer, when it kicks in, the little fellow will be reactivated and he can come find us. This is going to be the hardest of them all. Hold on, they're dragging us into the docking bridge. But we're here. I'll be quickly skipping through everything. So before people ask, I don't really care what is said, so... Except for this. Bastila, Karth, and the crew. Excellent. Have you seen? We found a disabled astromech droid in the back of the ship. Wipe its memory chips and take it to the junk pile. Maybe we can use some of its parts for salvage. And after Karth, this... It's been far too long since we last spoke. I see the recent months. Did you learn... Maybe I'll just cut uh, this. You're... We won't... You're... My I tied. In this gun. Perhaps. No. Ah. Yeah, it's not that fast. It's not that bad. The, this next part is what I'm worried about. Don't try to move too quickly. They tortured all of us. The dark side has perverted him. Unlike we should have. Like, None of this. It is. I, uh. No, I know you. I, I don't honestly know if I could have been as. Did you feel that? Well, then we better hope T3M4 busts us out of here before he arrives. Now we get to one of the most annoying things in this entire game. Why? Why would you? Why would you do this? All right. And now. You sense of a droid attempting to access your higher memory areas. You will need to take key opportunities to interfere with the process and slice the enemy droids in turn. Streaming numbers is being loaded into your memory core system. By completing the series, you can corrupt the data stream and disrupt the other droids programming. I don't like these, so I'm going to input them into a search engine see if I can get the answer. Okay, three. The sharp bus is dynamic. New series of numbers. It is ten. Because I've got all of them here. And the last one is eleven. If it's correct. There we go. If you fail, you game over. So, we want to get all these droid upgrades. upgrades which, I mean, is. Kind of not too great, except for this. We'll come back to that decommissioned droid. And let's go. Boop, boop, weep. Work. Beep, boop. Pair. And we're really great at this. And now. We got a decommissioned droid to help us fight. We'll open the door for it. actually needs to go down here. Yeah, this is a pretty slow droid. And we're 
are mainly doing this because of this guy. Because the other guys are not that bad. Also because I want to show off one nice little video that they added only for two three and no one else. And I just don't get it. Yeah, I'll look at everyone else, even HK doesn't get unique dialogue, but T3 does. Yeah, but the icebreaker is actually something that we absolutely need, because I don't believe... Oh wow, they actually went to kill, Jesus. Oh, uh, might as well open this. The icebreaker is needed. Grab, we can slice into it. But, I want to keep First release of force fails, because we might as well do this. Because extra experience. Both of them. Yeah, they didn't need to give us 99. Do not overload terminal. And now... Like I said, unlike the rest, I believe the T3 is the only one that needs to do that. You may be a droid. But when this is all over, I'm gonna see the Republic gives you a medal for your part in this. I if love I this. The layout of the ship, but our equipment that? should be in a storage chamber just this through the this north doors. Small episode. Grab our stuff. Uh, we need to get to the main uh, bridge controls. Star Wars the bridge Quarter. is the only place me that can open out. the docking gates see and you guys where they've got the Ebon Hawk. Next time. We have to open those I don't know when you guys are watching this, so. Eh. Moving. I can feel the dock 